For the holiday season is in full swing, meaning mail carriers have deadlines to meet if you want your packages to arrive in time for Christmas. Lisa Washington has more on the recommended dates that you need to know about before it's too late. It's the holiday season, and the U.S. Postal Service is already at work. This year's slogan is, we're ready. At the North Huntington Carrier Annex, carriers are prepared to handle the heavy volumes of mail. Our volume of parcels and letters is at least three times the volume. Three times as much. Easily, maybe more. The mail carriers will be working extended hours this holiday season. They want to make sure every package gets to its destination on time. They recommend these dates for mailing your packages. December 11th for those sent to military bases, the 14th for retail ground packages, December 20th for first class mail, the 21st for priority mail, and December 23rd, the most expensive option for Priority Express. The biggest challenge for the employees, the weather. The post office says the best way to help your carriers is to leave a clear path to your door and turn on your porch light. To our employees to be safe, and we are requesting our customers to help us out a little bit. Uh, we've got packages, packages being delivered early in the morning, sometimes as early as 6 a.m. So leaving a porch light on is incredibly helpful to us so we can know which house number, we're at the right location, and that goes into the evening too. When it comes to boxes, make sure they are sturdy. But if you're gonna choose your own, that's fine. Make sure it's not a box that's been used many times so that it's not as strong as it used to be. Package it well inside. You want to use foam or your bubble wrap or your peanuts, those foam peanuts, or newspaper works fine. Customers should also plan ahead and arrange to have their packages and their mail held if they'll be traveling over the holidays. Lisa Washington, KDKA News.